I think the most important thing that I've ever learned, and I, I don't know exactly where this would have come from, but it's just about not being a perfectionist. You know, for some people, they really have to have an inspiring sound to work with. For me, I've just found that working on, on the melody, you know, working on the chord progression, getting, getting the structure down, all these things I put before getting into sound design. But like, if, if you just want something that sounds this particular way, it's really easy to get lost in that and then lose kind of the spirit of the idea that you were first inspired with and maybe like forget what the melody was or you know forget the mood that you that you had that you wanted to go for. Um, so I, I always try to just get those big pieces in place first. I think there is something uh, important about just getting experience and, and learning things by doing them. Maybe it's good sometimes to not just like follow step by step every single thing in a tutorial, but also just experiment, see where, where your instincts lead you. That's definitely great. But also, you know, even today, if I just need to find some specific thing that I don't quite know how to approach it, I can YouTube it and the answer is right there. So that's also cool. Reverse reverb is one of my favorite effects. Just a really cool way to to create it like a swell or a transition to like get people excited for what's coming and then it just sounds like nothing else because it's like a reverb on your unique sound that you've flipped around. It's so easy to keep on working on something or, or uh, not be totally confident that what you've done is like the best thing it could ever be but you know you get to a certain point where you're doing stuff that no one is ever going to notice so you know rather than spending like five years perfecting like your supposed masterpiece like continuing to just make stuff and get it out there i think can be so much more rewarding i think it's really important to always be a student i really love exploring music and so you know i've been doing this forever and i still always I'm looking for that new thing to learn that you know, will either make my stuff sound better or make my workflow easier. And I think that's you know, not just for the sake of you know, make, making the, the product of my music better, but also just enjoying that process and enjoying what it's like to get better at something. I think music education is super important and that's why I do what I do.